Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. And I just had a thought in a, a hypothetical scenario where uh, this small town or that in the United States might choose to start producing counterfeit and uh, distributing it uh, to the tourists that come in. Um, I think that if the town is, is producing counterfeit or distributing it, we might consider it uh, perhaps a terrorist activity to fall under homeland security. Actually, technically, it's secession from the Union because they have chosen to set up their own paper currency in that case. Of course, nothing like that would happen here in the United States, but this is just a hypothetical sci-fi situation. And, and I have mentioned in the past, and I will mention once more, my feeling about such a scenario. Should it happen, I would suggest the cheapest way for the United States government to deal with a secessionist town would be to, to barricade the main roads in and out so the traffic can't move in and out. Basically, you have a, um, a siege situation going on. And I would also remove their uh, air flight and um, Walmart import of Walmart items uh, rights. That's what I would do. That's the cheapest thing. And if that didn't work, and if they tried to barge through the barricades and so forth, then you could always send in a commando unit or a pinpoint strike could be affected. But the thing about pinpoint strikes is that they, there are a lot of civilian casualties. I think twice about that, you know. So, I know, you know, national reserves and like that, they're very sh expensive to use and, and the nation is short on cash. That's why I suggest this alternative in case such a thing should ever come up. And I would say that if it did, which seems to me 99% impossible, that, uh, that we should expect it to only happen in one or two instances and then everyone else would, would fall back into line, I feel. Well, you'll forgive me for, for being so hard-nosed about this. That's what I think. I also think the CIA fact book should indicate American towns that are secessionist or terrorist in inclination so that, so that tourists would not be tempted to go there. That could be like a warning signal. Um, so, I don't know, my dad was a veteran of World War II and I guess even though I've never seen military action, I, I do have like a feel for, for military maneuvers and a concern for cost cutting in the, in the United States budget. So I'm hoping no towns would make that choice, but if they did, that would be my recommendation. You all take care and don't pass around counterfeit. It's important. Stand with U.S. of A.